Hey guys, welcome back. This week I'm back with another helpful video and in today's video I'm going to show you few of the products that has really helped me with everyday cooking. And if you are already a subscriber, you know that I make cooking videos, right? But one confession before I start, I'm actually very slow at cooking. At least I was in the past, but I have been looking for ways to improve my speed instead of like spending hours and hours in the kitchen making food. So I've been looking for like electronic gadgets that could help or tools that could make everyday cooking uh, faster and easier. And in this video, I'm going to talk about my most favorite tools that has helped me a lot. So make sure you watch till the end as it will help you with your everyday cooking as well. And let's start. The first thing I want to talk about is this electric chopper. I feel like chopper is the most important thing you will need in an everyday cooking. I have looked for and used different kinds of choppers but most of the manual choppers I used are okay but they are just a little hard for me especially when I am trying to do big quantities. So I was looking for a good electric and affordable chopper and I found this one on Amazon and when you are chopping onions using this electric chopper, cut the onions into 4 pieces and all you have to do is press this. This is how the chopper has cut the onions. You can also grind it longer for smaller pieces. And for tomatoes, you just have to cut off the top part and slit them into half. Just to show you guys, I only added one tomato, but you can add more tomatoes and it'll simply cut these into small slices. My most favorite part about this cutter is it's super easy to clean and you can clean like all of the parts very easily. The next thing I want to show you guys are these lids. I got these lids from India Amazon and basically like if you don't have lids to any of the bowls or if you're missing lids or if you just wanted to cover any like glass bowls like this, you can simply use these lids to store anything. And these also like come in different sizes and these are also like stretchable. So it fits different bowl sizes and I really like them because they come in handy. When I don't have lids and yeah you can simply store them in the fridge as well like this. The next thing I want to show you guys is the spices grinder especially when I'm cooking and if I want to make my own spice powder then I usually like roast the things that are needed for that particular recipe then if you do it in a big mixer or something it won't grind really well because the quantity will be very small but instead you could use this spice grinder i think this is a coffee grinder coffee beans grinder as well you can also like grind them but this would be very helpful especially for indian kitchen where we want to make different spice uh, powders here i just want to like grind these very um, small quantity you just have to put the things that you need to grind in here and all you have to do is like close the lid and just click on the press button. This is how it has grinded it. I don't want it like a fine powder for the recipe that I am making. This is a biryani powder that I have made before. See how fine this came out. And that's why like I really love this. You could grind really small quantities using this spice grinder. The next thing I want to talk about is this egg boiler. There's not much to really uh, talk about this but it's very helpful especially like when you want to boil eggs and you're not around this will automatically like turn off once it's done and you can also like boil eggs to soft level or medium or hard level. You just have to pour the right amount of water and one thing I want to show is like when you're buying an egg boiler uh, look for something that can do both like 7x and also like 14x. So this is especially helpful when you have like gas and you want to boil more eggs. I use this boiler a lot in everyday cooking. It's very helpful. Moving on to my most favorite kitchen item which is commonly found in every household. The mixer or the blender. I don't want to talk about like oh you get three jars and all that stuff. But this one I got it from India. It grinds really well but I especially want to talk about this small jar. I added in all the items that I want. Now this one comes with lock so it doesn't open up and spill everywhere. I really like this one. My most favorite part about this mixer is you could do this. So in small mixers usually like everything gets stuck up in, on the lid right. So you could simply do this and everything will fall down. And another favorite thing I have is this 
small opening that you have on the top where you can add water easily without opening the entire lid and also the lock system these three are like my most favorite unique items that i found in this mixer i'll link the product in the description box if you are interested there's also indian version and also us version of it uh, so yeah check out there if you are interested i think they also have mixer with four different jars but all of them comes with this nice lock system uh, which will be very helpful the next thing i want to talk about is this dish draining rug this is especially helpful when i don't want to use a dishwasher and quickly like wash smaller utensils you can also multi-purpose this and use this for cleaning the vegetables or green leaves this is very easy to set up and you can place this on any size sink that you have and when you don't want it you can simply like fold it and store it as well yeah it comes in really handy when you are cooking and washing utensils another favorite thing of mine are these reusable sponge cloths uh, this i got it from my mom but you can also find it on amazon in india and also in us this is especially helpful when cleaning the kitchen counters and also the areas around the sink and you can always like wash this using any soap or dishwashing soap and then you can dry it up and it's again reusable for next day it is also helpful to clean dirty stuff or any stains you have around it another favorite thing of mine that my mom has sent me is this chapati or roti making sheet you can also use this for baking purpose my most favorite part about this is when you do it on the wooden stand it's hard to like clean that wooden stand but it's super easy to clean this with soap and it's non slippery and non sticky which makes it very easy to make chapatis or rotis Moving on to our authentic Indian product, which we have in every household, uh, the mortar and the pestle. I looked for different kinds of them in the market and I wanted a granite set like this so I could make chutneys as well. It's so perfect for Indian kitchen and I just love it. Yeah, and that is all I got for this video. And if you find any of them helpful and if you need links for any of these products, please let me know in the comment section below and I will definitely reply there. If you have found this video helpful, please make sure to like this video and also do subscribe. I post new videos every week and every week it will be something different. And I make videos on DIYs, paintings, cooking and a lot more. So don't forget to subscribe and next week's video is going to be very interesting and very exciting. So stay tuned and I'll see you guys in another one. Bye-bye.